Forest Ramble Mini Match Report. On the one hand, it was just the second round of the Carabao Cup against a Derby team containing three fetuses. On the other, the Forest team was younger than Derby's and the players and manager showed that they really understood the occasion. There was a pleasing symmetry to our Ghanaian forward scoring as we paid tribute to our former Ghanaian forward and thanks to Derby fans for their applause for Junior Agogo. Albert Adoma then showed Tekkers to set up Joe Lolly's header. What a cross that was. Although João Carvalho's goal was fortunate, it was more brilliant build-up and Carvalho was in the right place at the right time. A word too for Brennan Johnson. What a fabulous performance, playing without fear, and he did really well in the hour that he was on the pitch. If Rafa Mir had beaten Ben Hamer from Brennan's approach play, then the Spaniard would surely have gone on to score more in the second half. Also, well done to Yuri Ribeiro, who had a great match at left back. He was like a little terrier, um, but showed some good skill. And of course, well done to Bruce Samba, even though he didn't even have a save to make. It's great for Joe Worrell to lift the trophy as the captain, but the last word with regards to the players has to go to Alpha Semedo and John Bostock. They were imperious. They were dictating play from central midfield from the first minute. Semedo providing brawn and the pace to set things up, and Bostock playing in the quarterback role that Ben Watson's done so well in, but showing that he really read the game very well um, and was really commanding. It is also really important to see that Bostock was just as excited by the victory as your Joe Worrells, as your Matty Cashes, um, with lots of fist pumping and screaming uh, as the final whistle went. Finally for now, well done to Sabri Lamushi. He really understood how important a derby match was, and he really communicated that occasion to the Reds players. 